What are you guys gonna do first? I'm gonna get my phone switched. Got a new phone, right? Boom. Boom, bad convinced me to get the bigger one. I used to get the bigger one like three years ago. But, <laughs> but you know, I was like, short and compact. Gets the job done. That's why yours cracked already, yeah? Why, because it's too big. No. iPhone logo. We've gotten rid. We've gotten rid of the edges, those round edges, and we've went straight slice and dice with thickness that builds integrity. And I promise you, it didn't bother you at all. Want you to go running? Struggling. I'm already put the phone in there. Look at it. It's because I'm shaking. And you gotta take it all the way out, man. Nah, I ain't about to use that shit. Hey. It look like it look like chitlins. Chitlins. He's so dramatic. Look, he's just literally just the band. <laughs> now you pop your phone in and put it around your waist. Shut that up. Shit ugly. All right, before we head to this gym, man, I just wanted to say, show some love to Alpha Clothing. Use code Aftermath, 15% off. I've been with this brand for five years. For five years. I've been with Alpha Clothing ever since I've gotten started with my whole YouTube, Instagram journey. They've supported me. Um, in my lowest, you know what I'm saying, and I'm, you know, I'm sticking by them and, and supporting them as well, and continually uh, showing my love and appreciation for the brand. So once again, if you guys are interested in some Alpha clothing, uh, use code Aftermath, 15% off. I also have some more Don't Touch uh, tees or maybe like a little few hoodies and stuff if you want to cop those as well. So just kind of want to get that out of the way, and uh, man, I'm about to, I'm about to walk in the gym like this. guys enjoyed the last video i think more training with odell and uh possibly some other nfl players uh coming go ahead to arizona train out there possibly exos get some full all athletic training ready to go yeah oh you ready on me i thought we were going separate why are we going separate we're gonna fucking sprint stuff sets of five is because we want to make sure our form is correct each time pulling up getting a high squeeze at the top and uh, usually our forearms get fatigued first when we do pull-ups so doing you know ten five sets of ten um, could you know fatigue you and you start losing your a good pull at the top so we're switching it over and doing ten sets of five so and this is just the beginning of the workout Not touching the floor, keep your back as parallel as possible. And we're going for 20 reps. We got four sets, 20 reps, that's 10 reps each arm. So what's happening is as we're doing a movement that pretty much counter a counteracting movement. We're trying to keep our form, trying to stay up because we're in a bent position. We're right here and we're trying to pull the weight in the opposite direction. Our, our gravity wants to pull us down, but we want to pull this weight up. So we're getting a lot of stability work as well in the lower back and those hips while we're trying to control and bring the, uh, bring the dumbbells to the chest and pull back.
right now, we're going into a little bit of back to shoulders because once again, the stronger your back, the more explosive and powerful you can pull back, the more speed and momentum you'll get forward. You need that balance from back to forth. You don't want to just be a push, you want to be a pull, that hard pull, and then push. So we're working on that right now. I got two, two about two and a half pound plates right now, focusing on my form. As I run, boom, trying to keep that elbow 90 degrees. As I go in, about, I don't know, like 10 seconds or something like that. And then drop it, do the same thing without. It's about that contrast training that I've talked about in videos in the past, where you do a weighted movement, and then a non-weighted, you get that euphoric feeling of speed a bit faster. It's like when you take a weight vest off, you feel faster, right? So you want to get your body used to feeling fast, and that's what's going to help you be faster. So we're going to do this for four sets. So about warmed up with some sprints. I mean, about warmed up for some sprints. Just doing a little jumping movements, get a little active, get the fast switches uh, going. Right now, we're gonna focus on five reps of getting in a position, using, using the shoulders, using the back, using that arm, throwing it back, and then sprinting. Just quick bursts, about like 10 meters, five each side, five left, five right. We wanna use that Boom, right here. Use elbow, bringing it down, going forward. We don't want to just turn too hard that it throws us out of place. And we don't, we need, as soon as we turn, when we turn, we need to be going. We don't need to turn, stagger, and then, you know, get going. You need to be able to do everything in one fluid motion. So, the movement is right here. Standing, boom, one, two, three, boom, boom. And apples. training again or like five or six o'clock doing two days kind of a three days because i wake up i do cardio do some mobility work stretching after that have a meal protein shake whatever come here and uh get some training done and then go elsewhere to uh get some more training done burn more calories i'm burning about yesterday i'm actually slacking today yesterday i burned working out wise like 3,000 calories uh just crazy high intensity um, that's, that's all, all my workouts together in one day. And um, today, I'm at 927 right now. I might just try to do a little bit more conditioning uh, outside uh, just to bump that over 1,000. Um, I'm, I'm burning calories right now. My heart rate is 130 at the moment. 
as I'm cooling down. Um, but uh, hopefully I, I might just hit the field instead, instead of just coming back to the gym, just hit the field, do some sprint stuff there. You already know I'm still getting my uh, 10 100 meter sprint in weekly. So everybody, 10 100 meter sprints. I don't want nobody in my comments talking about do a prowler, it's safer. Don't be a pussy. Get out there, run. You can't, that doesn't mean you have to run 100%. You can be 80% and still be in the safe zone. Um, but don't be a bitch. If you're really trying to get better, do what you need to do. Uh, get your conditioning done. Uh, gym workout. Uh, so now we're headed to get my phone fixed or my new phone. And then for the rest of the day, just vlogging for the rest of the day. Just finished up on the uh, video with me training with Odell and Vaughn. So definitely check that out. Just a simple video. I didn't have a videographer, so I had to have it stationary. Uh, but still got some work in. It's exporting right now. Um, and then we got my tree in. You know what I'm saying? My big tree. That's my big tree. Then we're going to replace this one over here with uh, another one of those. And then I got to actually, when to get the TV, I'm going to move the, this up a little bit more so it's not blending in so much with the tree. But I am loving the green in here. I am loving it, ladies and gentlemen.